Hey there, folks, and welcome to DXFan619 Plays Dead Effect. This was a game gifted to me on Steam by CTurok121, a Steam user, or uh, as he goes by on YouTube, iNinja32. I'll have links to uh, both of those uh, channels and the Steam profile in the description, so I thank him again for that. He's a great guy. And if you'd like to give to me bad games on Steam, uh, you're more than welcome to because they all go to good use for this channel. Although, I wouldn't say that this is a bad game. From what I've played of it, um, it's actually fine. It's actually, I'd, I'd even say, quite good. So, um, let's get into this. Uh, story. Uh, I'm gonna go with new game because I have to show you guys something. Okay, so... Gunner Davis is our male protagonist, uh, and he has a primary weapon of an assault rifle, and he has a special ability of bullet time. Now, I thought that he would have the exclusive ability of bullet time, but it also turns out that our female protagonist does too, Jane Frey. Um, I've been meaning to check something out with the uh, voice acting on this, and uh, I think I'm going to go with her because I do like his loadout better. Uh, I'm more of an assault rifle guy than a shotgun guy, which is what she has, but I haven't seen the voice acting for the female yet. I've seen it for the male, and it's, it's, eh. So, let's go with her, and let's see what, um, what happens. Uh, auto heal, nah. Uh, difficulty medium, sure. Let's go. You will lose all your previous, yeah, that's fine, I don't care. Alright. I should mention that... Um, what was I going to say? I should mention that I've been instructed to shoot these guys in the head because they will royally fuck me up if I, if I do anything but that. If I try to, like, you know, take them on with maybe, like, an assault rifle and shoot them in the body or the torso or the legs, um, it's not going to work. So, uh, as Leon Kennedy would say, shoot them in the head. Delta 3 chamber active. Tissue and vital function check. Error. Destruction detected. Restart. Emergency nano trait activation launch. Three, two, one. Awakening. It is Wednesday, September 7th, 2045. Day 178 from the beginning of the hibernation. Critical state of health detected. Medi station now active. Healing process Let's see what's going on here. Uh so H switches you to the direction of your objective. Uh you can interact with objects uh with space. Um uh, this is something I have to go to. I have to go down into here. Alright, there's blood here. Oh, shit. The fuck was that? Oh, F for flashlight, by the way. Uh, okay. Electromagnetic stun gun. A thousand volts at a single shot. Uh, this voice acting is quite good. Uh, press right for iron sights. And I just want to say something, but the level of detail in this environment, uh, because this this was, uh, to my knowledge, this was an Android and iPad game. It was a tablet game that got ported to PC, and just the the amount of detail here is crazy. I mean, this is a, a brilliant looking game for for the port. It was. Uh, this is actually how to do this right instead of you know Deus Ex: The Fall, that fucking piece of shit. I own that game too. Um, but look at the detail on this on this glove. That's just that's absolutely crazy. Uh, but let's go. And the the female voice acting is pretty good. Uh, although I would like to address one complaint I have. Uh, the running is just kind of strange. Like like the camera will zoom in uh, to where you need to be going. That's kind of disorienting. Okay, search the area. Uh, I don't want to go down there yet because I think. Well, no, never mind. I have to go down there. I thought there was a door. Yeah, I see access denied. Okay. Uh, unlock. What is this? 
Oh, sweet. Okay. Okay, credits. You have credits, I assume, that you can buy uh, weapons and, and ammo with those. Hello? What's going on here? Oh, shit. Alright, so I have to be very, very close in order for this to work. Oh, shit. Okay, there we go. And now it needs to recharge. Uh, there we go. And he's dead. Or she's dead. That was a female. Oh, shit. Okay. And he's dead, too. Get a pistol. Okay. I'd like to say that this is uh, a different pistol than the, the one that the male has. Uh, the male has more of a, a standard uh, uh, pistol. He, she has a, she has a different one. I'm not sure of the right terminology right now. It's slipping my mind. All right. Also, let me see something in the settings uh, options because this is kind of bothering me. Uh, audio. Huh, they're all the same. Master volume, music. Let's put the music down a little because I can barely hear her. All right. Uh, some more credits. Oh, and a grenade. Sweet. Okay. And this is uh, this is a log, I guess. Uh, hey, Davis. Uh, I'm a bit bored here, so I figured. Got our messages. I just hate the feeling of someone reading my personal mail. Use that primitive algorithm we learned as recruits back at the base. I hope you can remember. I wonder if you have a bit of a brain left under all that muscle. Try to use it out. <laughs> Try it out. Uh, okay, so this is uh, this is setting up the story. There is uh, there is a plot here, and I guess the story is told through tablets. Um, I like that form of storytelling, just uh, not not really showing uh, showing the uh, the player what's happening, but just telling them and uh, making them read it. I, I kind of like that. Jesus Christ! Okay, I want to see if this I want to see if the iron sights in this game are as bad as I remember them being. See, yeah, you know, I just, I aimed directly at that guy's head, and I missed. See, look at that. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's, uh, that's kind of bothersome. I might not use, uh... Oh, hold on. I should probably be saving my ammo. I don't know why I'm, uh, why I'm, uh, using all this gun ammo up. Okay. Alright. Here's credits, and here's a locker. Oh, wait a minute, I can't, I can't go in here yet, I don't think. Uh, let's see what's over here. So yeah, the iron sights, uh, are no good, to be honest. The iron sights, it, it's kind of... They they don't line up maybe properly with the uh, the shots. They just meh. Okay, now there's some more motherfuckers over here. Okay, watch this. Okay, that worked. Oh, I have to reload. How many bullets do I have? Uh, okay, let's just because these guys these guys are slow. Why, uh, why, why bother wasting all that ammo? Just conserve it. You're dead. Now, there should be another tablet over here. Okay, we got some ammo. Uh, also, one thing, uh, I don't think you can jump in this game. Um, there is no jump, which would let you get away from these guys, but I don't think there's a jump, because space is, uh, space serves the use of F here, where you would press F to, you know... Pay your respects. <laughs> but, um, you can't jump. I don't think you can. Okay, here's another tablet. 
Uh, in the name of the ESS Meridian Science Team, I wish to inform you that we have concluded our research of the effects that the FTL motors have on the crew and equipment. The good news is that the motors do not have any negative impact on human impacts on human health. However, we have uncovered that the motor the motors have a negative effect on some of the ship's construction materials. We are currently trying to solve this issue together with the ship's officers. We believe that uh, the issues will cause no complications. So see, like I said, I like that uh, that form of storytelling. That's the uh, form of storytelling in Unreal, really. Uh, Unreal is one of my favorite games of all time, and there is no dialogue in Unreal. It's just picking up a bunch of messages that you find on uh, dead bodies, and I think that's really cool. Um, is there really no way to go over there? Let me check the controls. Maybe I'm just being an idiot and there is a way to jump. Uh, control mappings. Uh, hold on. Uh, move forward, backward, left, right, up, down, left, right, fire, aim, reload, previous, next, bullet time, uh, use, menu, exit. Huh, okay, so I guess there isn't a way to jump. Uh, let's try out bullet time. Okay, I guess I don't have bullet time yet. Um, but it was, it's okay. It was like that in Fear 2 where you didn't get bullet time until like, like 20 minutes into the game. Um... Here's another tablet. Uh, sleeping while I'm working my ass off over here. Well, more bored than working still. This is from Hayes. This is from the guy from before. Uh, remember that tall blonde from your unit, Jane Frey? We both wondered how such a fragile girl could get in. I managed to get into the crew database. I found some interesting data about our beauty. Her parents are unknown. So I'm playing as Jane Frey right now. Uh, she's been in the army registry since she was five. Sounds like a child lab. Oh, yeah. So I'm apparently a lab rat. Okay. Almost every military program in existence. He's been actively participating in military conflicts since she was 16. Uh, started off in espionage, then moved to the attack forces. Her statistics say that she has over a hundred kills and more medals than I knew existed. She is almost, uh, entirely improved by implants, uh, except... Hold on to something. Her boobs. <laughs> Still a real piece of woman, eh? <laughs> but don't provoke her much when asking her out. You may be the biggest badass of us all, but I think that chick would easily break your neck during a kiss. Sweet. So, okay. It, uh, Gunner seems to be a normal human. The, the, uh, the other guy. The guy I was playing as before, before I started, you know, actually recording for this video. But uh, this chick seems to be a, a, a sort of... What the fuck was that? Yeah, I should mention, if it, if it isn't obvious by now, we're on a spaceship called the USS Meridian. Oh, shit. Okay, so I've been thinking maybe the iron sights don't work, maybe because I'm not using them right. Like, I think I have to line up the red dot to a head. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck me. Okay, hold on. I I'm prepared for this. Okay, so slow-mo was just activated there. At least I think it was for a second, or that was just lag. Alright, motherfuckers, come on now. Okay, hold up. Okay, this is another case of conserving ammunition. He's dead. You're dead. And now you are too. Sweet. Okay. Ammo, credits, uh, there's a ru oh shit. Oh, fuck me. Oh, fuck, the fucking iron sights missed again. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck me. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, you're dead, asshole. And... Oh, fuck. What the fuck? Okay, that killed him. So, do these guys have more health, or was I just missing like an idiot? Uh, let me reload. Alright. 
So this is an interesting storyline so far. I'm not going to lie. Uh, it's, it's interesting. I like games like this. Just games that set you in a situation and then you have to, you know, fend for yourself uh, while exploring the world. Like I said, Unreal is one of my favorite games and Unreal is like that. Uh, oh, okay. So there's, there's, uh, there's these stations here that uh, give you health. Um, that's good. Uh. This is an automatic status report. September 7th, 2045. Unwelcome activity in the station. Activation of Section 13. No result. Mm-hmm. Weird. Nothing more to find out here. Leave the hibernation quarters. Uh, there's something here. I really like that, uh, that system. Uh, okay, so now we have more ammo. Uh, let's, let's go here. Alrighty then. Uh, okay, we have to go through here. Oh, fuck me. You know what I just got a flashback of right now? And uh, and I, I'm surprised it's taken me this long to draw this comparison to the to this game, but this game reminds me of Doom 3. Uh, the, the crazy dark corridors and, you know, the zombies in space idea, or, oh shit. Oh fuck, man, the, the, what the fuck? I was moving a little weird there. Uh, okay. So I have a magnum, that's what I have, I should have mentioned that a long time ago. Uh, some more credits. What is this? Is this, a? Uh... Oh, sweet, so there's, um, there's, like, levels, it's not just one big sprawling environment. Okay, so, uh, accuracy, 82%, yeah, I kind of fucked up on that. Headshots, 25, killed monsters, 33, I took 15, kind of, almost 15 minutes to finish this. Uh, I didn't find any of the secret orbs, uh, I guess I should go back for that. Um, and there were seven tablets, so I guess I really fucked up there, didn't I? Huh. Huh. So I gotta go back. I, I wanna go back now. But um I think I'm gonna wrap it up for this video because I have um I have some other stuff I have to play, and it's not nearly as good as this, but uh yeah. Uh so if you guys made it to the end of the video, thank you, and uh I will keep playing this game, just I don't think for YouTube, I'll I'll play it by myself. But this uh this is a decent game. This is not something that I would consider bad. Of all the trash, just the unlimited amounts of trash that make its way onto Steam nowadays. Uh, this is this is great, and I think there's going to be a sequel to this. So uh, I'm I'm excited for that because this is actually a good game, and it it seems to have a good plot. So I'm going to keep playing it. So uh, again, thank you to uh, C Turok or I Ninja Thirty Two, and uh, like I said, if you guys want to gift me bad games on Steam, they're always welcome because they always go to good good use for this channel. Like dead bits, that uh, stinking pile of shit. So, uh, thank you guys for watching if you made it to the end, and uh, peace out. See you guys later.